you in. 866-735-2470. Our number today is 8 8- Five five six six zero forty two sixty one. We'll get to your phone calls here in the next segment. We're talking about this, uh, what I call the, the foundational idea of the bright side, the triangle of the disease. The body breaks down sequentially. Digestive system breaks down first. The blood sugar system breaks down second. The energy complex system, which is the adrenal glands and the thyroid, break down third. And it's not a doctor issue, but a doctor will tell you it's his issue because doctors like power. And this is why... Even centuries ago, 250 years ago, Thomas Jefferson, referring to the American people, said, if people let the government decide what the foods, what foods they eat and what medicines they take, their bodies, this is a quote, by the way, direct quote, if people let the government decide what foods they eat and what medicines they take, their bodies will soon be in as sorry a state as are the souls who live under tyranny, unquote. Thomas Jefferson. Now, this is a link that the founding fathers made with government tyranny, between government tyranny and medical tyranny. Tyranny is tyranny is tyranny. It's taking power away from you and me, taking power away from the citizens and putting it into some kind of authority system. Whether that authority system is government, whether it's police, or whether it's doctors. Thomas Jefferson was no dummy, and he knew this 250 years ago. Benjamin Rush, another signatory to the, uh, to the Declaration of Independence, himself a medical doctor, Dr. Benjamin Rush said, quote, this is 250 years ago, folks, quote, to restrict the art of healing to one class will constitute the Bastille of medical science. In other words, it will destroy medical science. All such laws are un-American and despotic, as in tyranny. A despot is a tyrant. Continuing, unless we put medical freedom into the Constitution, the time will come when medicine will organize into an undercover dictatorship. Hello, people. Does this sound familiar? The time will come when medicine will organize into an undercover dictatorship and force people who wish doctors and treatment of their own choice to submit to only what the dictating outfit offers. That's a fancy way of saying doctors and the medical model will steal power every time they can get it. And this is Dr. Benjamin Rush talking in the 1700s, the late 1700s. What they were talking about, what these wise, prescient founding fathers were talking about, is exactly what is occurring today, and unfortunately, with our complicity, with our volition, we are letting them do it to us. We are living in the medical tyranny that these founding fathers warned us about 250 years ago, except for we are shockingly, voluntarily submitting to, even honoring our slave masters, even deifying this authority system. And what good has it done? We are the sickest culture on the planet, despite our medical deities. We are the sickest culture in the history of the planet, despite our medical deities. Despite the supposed advances of medicine, a hundred million Americans are obese or overweight. A hundred million Americans have diabetes and degenerative diseases. More if you include degenerative diseases. But you know what, folks? The good news is, We can take back our power. We can live fully and completely without ever having to walk into a doctor's office ever, except for, God forbid, some kind of trauma. We can, as my friend Dr. Glidden says, fire our MD. We should fire our MD. Have you ever heard of a doctor curing anything? Have you ever heard of a doctor curing diabetes? No. They tell you you're going to be on your prescription drugs the rest of your life and keep eating your snack foods and make sure it's low fat. That's doctor wisdom. In fact, if you do ever step into a doctor's office for anything other than getting hit by a car or some kind of accidental acute trauma, you are, in fact, implicitly and explicitly and literally giving up your power and self-governance. If you do something or take something because they told me I had to take it, they got mad at me. I hear this all the time. My doctor got mad at me because I didn't want to take the medicine, because I didn't want to take my poison. My doctor got mad at me. I hear this all the time. If you take something because my doctor 
doctor told me to, or they put me on medicine, you have given up your power, you have given up your authority, authority, you've let them infantilize you, and you've given up your ability to be self-governing about the most fundamental aspect of governing itself, which is health, our bodies. If, on the other hand, you're dealing with a chronic degenerative disease, and it's obvious to you, as it should be, that the idiotic medical model of surgery and steroids is not helping you, here's what you need to do. It's simple. Return to the triangle. Return to the triangle of disease. Backtrack to the triangle of disease. No matter what your health condition is, given that it's a degenerative disease, degenerative health condition where the body's falling apart, return to the triangle. Start with the digestive system. Always, 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 always degenerative disease is secondary to digestive distress. Degenerative disease is secondary to digestive distress. The body's like a circle. It's closed. There's no way to get inside a circle. That's the definition of a circle. It's closed. Technically, we call it a closed system, except in the body, there's three little portals. There's three little portals technically, but for practical purposes, there's only one portal into the circle. There's only one way into the body. There's only one way into the circle that we call the body. The body's pristine. The body's perfect. There's only one entryway into this circle of this closed system that we call the body. There's only one practical way for anything to get into this closed system to disturb it. There's only one doorway, window, portal into this circle, and that doorway, opening, window, portal into this circle is through food and digestion. Yes, you can get stuff in through the nose and the skin. Technically speaking, these are routes into the circle, but by far and away, the most likely port of entry into this pristine circle, this holy sacred, divine space that is called the human body, the only way into it, the only way inside the body is by what we put in our mouths and what we are eating. Over time, as wrong things get into this pristine, holy, sacred space of the body, the digestive system becomes inflamed, the digestive tract becomes irritated, it begins to break down, and once this, this pipe that we call the digestive system breaks down, you have begun the degenerative process, and it occurs, it begins to occur shockingly early. At birth for many people, prenatally for some people, in the womb for some people, certainly by the time most of us are two or three or four years of age, if we're indulging in the standard American diet, we have begun the digestive breakdown and the road to degenerative disease has become, has, has been initiated. And at that point, complete healing and reversal cannot occur. And this is why we get put on drugs at a very early age. This is why it's so important to know the effects of what we're eating, to notice digestive symptoms, and then to link them with foods. There's so much more to talk about here, folks. I want to continue talking about the triangle tomorrow. I still want to talk about the electrical nature of what we eat. We don't eat for food. We don't eat for the solid stuff. We eat for the electricity. And we'll be continuing to talk about this in the coming days on the Bright Side. We're coming back with your phone calls right after this, folks. Don't go away. If you're worried about your health and you're tired of the nasty side effects of harsh drugs or antibiotics, then look no further. Supernatural Silver is the answer. Supernatural Silver is a powerful immune system enhancer that can be used every day to help keep you healthy and well with none of those nasty side effects. It's extremely safe for use internally as well as topically. And Supernatural Silver is hundreds of times more effective than colloidal or ionic silver. It is perfect for use in the sinuses, eyes, ears, and on any wound or skin issue. Supernatural Silver is also extremely effective when taken orally and can help fight off bacteria, viruses, and mold that may be overwhelming your immune system. Go to SupernaturalSilver.com SupernaturalSilver.com and use the promo code SILVER Over 2014 for 20% off of your entire order and give yourself and your loved ones a fighting chance with Supernatural Silver. Mother's Day is right around the corner. If you haven't ordered your Mother's Day flowers yet, make sure to visit ProFlowers.com for an amazing deal. ProFlowers has a Mother's Day special for radio listeners. Get 100 gorgeous blooms for mom with a free glass vase for $19.99. And if you want to make her day even more special, upgrade to a premium vase and add gourmet chocolates for just $9.99 more. Mom will be so happy when she unwraps her beautiful bouquet of blooms, guaranteed to stay fresh and beautiful for at least one full week. 
Each time she looks at her Mother's Day flowers, she'll think of you. But hurry, this deal expires soon, so make sure to place your order today. The only way to get this incredible deal is to go to proflowers.com slash radio right now and enter the code PLOW, P-L-O-W, proflowers.com slash radio code PLOW, P-L-O-W. That's proflowers.com slash radio and enter code PLOW, P-L-O-W. We live in a complicated society. Stressful issues are always popping up. Have you ever been treated unfairly by someone? Have you ever been overcharged for a repair? Have you ever signed a contract or a document worried about identity theft? How many times have you been in those unique situations where you just wanted to call an attorney to find out if you're right or wrong or what your legal rights are? But every time you think about calling an attorney, what do you think about first? That's right. Who do you call and how much will it cost? Our friends at Legal Shield have found a solution. With a nationwide network of 6,900 attorneys who average 19 years of experience, Legal Shield's law firms take over 40,000 calls per week helping their members. For less than $20 per month, you can have access to Legal Shield on everything from the trivial to the traumatic. Let Legal Shield stand up for your rights at lsprotection.com. That's lsprotection.com. Or call 855-340-SAVE. 855-340-7283. Results will vary from case to case. This alert just came in. This special announcement is for business owners and leaders of organizations who've been waiting for the right time to build. General Steel has made it impossible to wait any longer with rock-bottom prices that could save you thousands. That's right. General Steel, America's leader in pre-engineered structures, is offering buildings at prices you will never see again. Don't miss these prices. A 50 by 100 for $35,000. You heard right. That's 5,000 square feet for $35,000. Many if you need a larger building, try a 100 by 100 commercial building for 129000 You can't afford to rent with these prices. Imagine a 70 by 100 foot church building for under $69,000. With the economy improving and interest rates still at historic lows, you can't afford to wait. So call 866-91-STEEL. Lock in your price now. Call 866-91-STEEL. That's 866-917-8335. For over five years, you've been hearing about the Berkey guy, so you may know a few things about him. For example, you are well aware of the superior quality and effectiveness of Berkey water filters and accessories. But did you know the Berkeys have had independent lab tests done to prove just how effective they are? It's true, and he can email you the test results. Just visit GoBerkey.com. You may also know that the Berkey guy has helped tens of thousands of people get better prepared. Now here's something you may not know. GoBerkey.com has amazing specials and deals all the time on a wide variety of survival and preparedness products. Most ready to ship same day. Visit the Berkey guy at GoBerkey.com and be sure to click the red Products on Sale Now button. You can always call toll-free 877-886-3653. Again, that's 877-886-3653. GoBerkey.com, home of the Berkey guy. Free from the shackles of corporate America, we're the place for independent thinkers. G-C-N. All right, we are back on the bright side. I am Pharmacist Ben. Thank you for joining us, friends. Eight five five six six zero forty two sixty zero sixty one is our number. That's eight five five six six zero forty two sixty one. If you want to learn more about the longevity products, check out brightsideben.com or give the Brightside Ben phone team a call at eight six six seven three five twenty four seventy. All right, uh, we'll continue talking about the triangle and the triangle of disease and electrical food, electrical nutrition, if you will, the electrical nature of health. We'll continue that discussion over the coming days. So you're going to want to tune into the bright side in the next few days, at least, if you're interested in uh, reversing the degenerative disease process, which is simple to reverse. Once you remove the bad stuff and put the good stuff back in, we'll be continuing this discussion over the next few days. Uh, 855-660-4261, time to hit our phones. Let's go. Go to Rick in Illinois. What's going on, Rick? Welcome to the Bright Side. 
Good morning, uh, Ben. Thanks for taking my call. Sure. I was the uh, final caller on last Friday's show and didn't get to finish up, so I'll, I'll start over again. Okay. Uh, I have tinnitus in my left ear, and okay. although it is a problem I'm trying to resolve, it's not the primary reason why I'm calling you today. Okay. Um, I saw my ENT on February 5th to have my ears cleaned, which I do at least annually. Um, on I saw my GP on February 13th for a persistent cough and what felt like chest congestion. He noted that he saw a fluid build up behind my left eardrum, which explained, which explained why uh, I'd been hearing a rustling sound in the left ear and why it felt like it was blocked. Um, he also noted that I had post-nasal drip, which was a likely cause of the persistent cough and the congested feeling in my chest. Um, my question for you is what might have caused the fluid build